Welcome back to another tutorial. This is about a concept that I kind of wish was online when I was doing it for my own side project. So I thought I'd make a little tutorial to help people out that are kind of going through the same bug as me. So this one's going to be placing buttons wherever on a GUI. Um, this is all the code you need right here. Uh, the entire class is going to be in the description. So no need to write the lines off the screen. If you want to copy and paste one of them from the description, go ahead and do that. So I wrote a little, wrote a little example program to kind of illustrate what's going on here. What I mean by writing buttons anywhere. So it's going to pull up a little frame. It's going to have this button in an exact position that I specified. A lot of people struggle with like north, south, east, west, and like grid layouts. And if you're writing a program that you can kind of fix the frame size, it's a good time to kind of just put the buttons where you want to because it's kind of the size of the GUI. It's going to be there every single time. So kind of getting into how I did this. So what you're going to need to do is this key line right here, of setting the panel layout to null is kind of how you're able to set the balance to wherever you want for a bunch of different labels or buttons or whatever you're doing. So yeah, so once you have the layout set, then you can go down to this button and the set bounds method is kind of where you're, you're able to set things where you want them to be. So this would be zero, zero, obviously. So this is the 200, 120, and then you can set the size and the width. Then that's really the main two lines and setting the frame visible at the bottom. Um, this is very useful, like I said, for images, buttons, labels, text fields, kind of customize the GUI you want without having to use these overbearing constraints. And yeah, that's how I did it.